the Portfolio Committee on Public Enterprises says it hopes the new CEO will be able to pull ESCOM out of its crisis. Joining me now is Committee Chair Akaya Magatla. Thank you so much for your time this morning, Mr. Magatla. Um, I think you know, first and foremost, we know that the Parliamentary Committee welcomed the appointment of Mr. Dan Marokane as the new ESCOM CEO. Um, I think let's first start with what factors really contributed to the, the committee's positive um, reception of Mr. Marugane? Well, our worry about the process was that it must not produce outcomes that will be questionable, meaning that a person whose qualification is questionable, a person whose experience is also questionable. Uh, the reason why we could not waste time to welcome Mr. Marokane is the fact that he has been at ESCOM before. And then he's a person who has um, a, a skill and the experience of dealing with the energy sector. Therefore, in those bases, we are comfortable with him um, because we are from a particular questionable process and that produced questionable outcomes in the name of the previous uh, CEO whose knowledge and the experience of this sector was questionable, including his own skills in terms of uh, qualification was questionable. Hence, he could not take us out of this load shedding. This one, we have good hopes that at least he meet those minimum requirements. Okay, let's talk about that. Uh, you mentioned former ESCOM CEO, Andrew.